Now let us solve few problems based on the angle. So in the given figure, name the points in the interior of angle DOE in the exterior of angle EOF on angle EOF. So if you see the figure, we have to find the point or points in the interior of angle DOE. So in the interior of angle DOE, so there is only one point, so that is A. So this is the point inside the angle DOE, means in the interior. Next, in the exterior of angle EOF, exterior of angle EOF, so there is a point C and there is a point A and also D. So these are the three points in the exterior of the angle EOF, C, A, D. Now on angle EOF, on angle EOF, so we can write E, B, O, F. So these four points E, B, O, F, so these are the four points on the angle EOF. Next, draw rough sketch, rough diagrams of two angles such that they have one point in common. We should draw the two angles such that they have only one point in common. So then how to draw the two angles which have only one point in common? So we can draw two intersecting lines. AP and CD. So these two intersecting lines. So these two lines intersect at O. So we can say that angle AOD angle BOC have only one point in common that is O. So the common point is O. And we can also write these two angles which are, which are having only one point in common. Angle AOC, angle DOB. Now we should draw two angles such that two points in common. So how to draw the two angle such that they have two points in common. So we can draw now this P Q R R Q S. Yes. So these two this angle P Q R angle R Q S. Yes. So these two rays, these two angles have the two points in common Q and R and next one ray in common. So the two angles such that one ray in common is same as this figure L, M, N, T. The two angles here are also the two angles L, M, N and N, M, T. So these are the two angles which have one ray in common. So the common ray is M, N. Now let us discuss what is a triangle. A simple closed figure formed by three line segments is called a triangle. So any simple closed figure consisting of three line segments is called a triangle. Now if you draw the triangle ABC, now this is the simple closed figure formed by three line segments such as AB, BC and AC. So this is called a triangle. and it is a three sided polygon. So, a three sided polygon or a simple closed figure formed by 
थ्री लाइन सेगमेंट इज कॉल्ड ए ट्राइंगल और ए थ्री साइडेड पॉलीगन is a triangle so triangle abc can be written as triangle abc now the line segments which form the triangle are called its sides so a triangle has three sides ab BC and AC, and it has three vertices. So where the two sides meet, there one vertex is formed. So it has three vertices as A, B, and C, and it has three angles. It's at each vertex there is an angle formed. So we can write angle A. angle b angle c and a triangle divides the plane into three parts such that one is interior and the second is the exterior and the third is on the triangle so first one interior the second one exterior and the third one on the triangle so if you take any point p it is in the interior of the triangle and the point q in the exterior of the triangle and a point r on the triangle and the vertices also lie on the triangle and it is a a triangle is a polygon with the least number of sides so we cannot form any polygon with two sides so a triangle is a polygon with the least number of sides so we can write that triangle is a polygon with the least number of sides means three sides now let us solve a problem based on the triangles so from the given figure identify three triangles in the figure so we can take the three three triangles in the figure so the first triangle is triangle abc so triangle abc and the second one is triangle abd and third one is triangle acd the next question write the names of seven angles so in this two in this three triangles so there are seven angles formed here so first angle angle b comma angle c next angle b a d angle a d b next angle d a c next angle a d c so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and the next angle is angle b a c so these are the seven angles formed in these three triangles and next one is write names of six line segments so we can write the line segments ab is a line segment next ac is a line segment next 
बी डी डी सी नेक्स्ट ए डी इज अलाइन सेगमेंट सो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव एंड द नेक्स्ट वन इज बी सी इज ऑल्सो ए लाइन सेगमेंट सो दीज आर द सिक्स लाइन सेगमेंट्स एंड विच टू ट्राइंगल्स हैव एंगल बी एज कॉमन सो द ट्राइंगल ए बी डी ट्राइंगल ए बी डी एंड ट्राइंगल ए बी सी हैव एंगल बी एज कॉमन So the next question draw a rough sketch of triangle abc now mark p in its interior mark q in its exterior is a in the interior or in the exterior now first let us draw a triangle abc So this is a triangle ABC. Now we should mark a point P in the interior of triangle ABC. So let us mark a point P in the interior of triangle ABC, and a point Q in the exterior. Now mark point Q in the exterior. So here, and what about the point A? Whether it is in the interior or exterior? In the exterior. so it does not lie in the interior or it does not lie in the exterior exterior so it, the point a lies on the circle so we can write no a lies on the circle if you like this video please give a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on cbse syllabus